I am Alex from the Watergate Street Gallery. Uh, we're an independent art gallery, so we've got no publisher ties, so we can put what we want on the wall. So we try and put a real eclectic mix together. Uh, this is the UK's number one artist, Kerry Darlington, who I've dealt with since she was in college 15 years ago. So we're the first gallery in the UK to publish her work or display her work. Um, this is Lee Lambert whose paintings um, depict childhood memories, so he's reliving his dad's childhood through his art. And it's just what you remember as a kid, whether it's the chippy or the sweet shop or the space hopper. Um, another room here, a couple of collectible pieces there from um, of Austria, this is a French artist part of the room. Um, these are David Wilde, which is uh, possibly the most investable of pieces in here. He painted out of Salford at the same time as Lowry. Uh, these were found in a wardrobe where they've been for 40 years. So um, incredible paintings, really futuristic for his time. Um, international artists painting locally for us. We commission a lot of local art as well. Uh, right down to these, which are painting with the hair of the brush. Um, Again, just a mishmash of work in here from Italy. We've got an artist here whose dad stole a Lowry many years ago, so he puts a cop and a robber in each one of his paintings, so it's quite an amusing story. Um, we've got art from the Amalfi Coast, so this guy's got a nice job. He walks up and down the Amalfi Coast painting. Um, local artists, again, who we've dealt with for many years. Um, it's again, it's one of the past UK number one best-selling artists, um, Sue Howes, and we commissioned her to do some Chester prints. German etchings, um, again, local art. This is an artist called Ian Fenley, with really urban twist on, um, on Chester's back streets and main streets. This is the same artist, very paints in colour.